Well, Jim himself is a musician, and I would say, even though he's a, a master of cinema, he he operates very often as a mu as a musician. In fact, on the set, it's uh, it, it feels very often more like a, a sort of session with musicians, jamming than than it than it does working with a director who's following a, a sort of very set down script. And of course, he's very close with with Riza and with Iggy and uh, with Tom. And it was uh, it was only right and fitting that they should be there. Yeah, it was fun. I didn't, I wasn't there when Iggy was there, but or, or Riza. But I know Riza, and he's a delightful person. He's one of the. He's a, just a. He's a. He's a towering figure in the music business. But I had a lot of fun eating dinner with Tom Waits. I realized and. I made him laugh, and it, it felt so great to make him laugh because he has a—he seems to be such a serious cat, you know. But to make him laugh, and he really was enjoying himself, and he made me laugh. But I made him laugh, and he has a beautiful tinkle of a laugh that's mm -hmm. just so sweet it comes out of him. So uh, the humor that he writes into his songs always seems a little on the ironic, or maybe a little bit uh, like what, what people would call black humor, but. I found him to be a, just a great, great laugher. So mm -hmm. for me, that was a treat to know that uh, there was a guy with a, even though he's got a big beard and crazy hair and raggedy clothes, he's a funny, funny laugher. Mm -hmm. This is really awful. I'm thinking zombies. What? Are you in this together? Did she just say Chardonnay? Yeah, she did. They don't die. The worst thing I've ever seen.